Hi, everyone. It is February 25, 2018. I want to thank my subscriber for sending along these articles to me. Miami Dade releases Wolbachia male mosquitoes to fight Zika. Hey, Florida, you're going to get zapped once again with these genetically modified mosquitoes. The Kentucky firm, Mosquito Mate, has begun releasing Wolbachia male mosquitoes, officially launching the Miami-Dade County Mosquito Reduction Test Program in the city of South Miami. The U.S. Environmental Protection Agency approved biotechnology product sold as the ZAP mosquito will be released regularly in the Twin Lakes neighborhood through July. Isn't that great? And if you hear talking, it's my neighbors right next door. Yes, the Wolbachia male mosquitoes do not bite or blood feed and are incapable of transmitting pathogens that cause human disease. The released male mosquitoes mate with female mosquitoes in the area and the resulting eggs do not hatch, which can reduce the mosquito population that can transmit mosquito-borne viruses. Yes. They're so concerned about your health that they are releasing genetically modified mosquitoes so that you don't get any mosquito-borne illness. Our government, they love us. Oh, what is this, 66 million in all? What? They're releasing how many? 66 million? Six, six, six? Really? In our face? Wow. Well, what's interesting is here, Miami-Dade County was previously designated as a Zika cautionary area, but that designation was removed last year, June 2nd. But hell, let's release 666 genetically modified Mosquitoes to protect you guys in Miami-Dade County, Florida. Six, six, six. I don't think that these mosquitoes are harmless.